Hello everybody, this is Buttertoast the Third, and welcome to part five of my limbo walkthrough. And uh when we left off we escaped a giant rock. So, here we are. And now we gonna come we gonna we gonna come. We're going to come over here and we're going to stand on this thing. And we're gonna wait for it to rotate so that we can come over here. Actually we didn't even need to wait for it. But here we are. Ah, oh, so close. So close. So, now we're going to come over here. And we're actually going to come back up here. And turn back around. over here and bam it's somewhere new holy cow that's pretty crazy so we're gonna want to time this pretty good now and we're gonna run and go over here all right so we're going to time this we're gonna jump up on here and we're going to come through here and run! I didn't... Okay, there we go. And now what we want to do is we want to time a box. So that we can come up here and fail at life. We want another box. And we want to actually have a good time to be on the box. And get up. And there it is. And there we are. Alright, I'm going to need to stop... Well, alright. And up we go. So I have to... Oh, okay. Don't fall. That's that's not a good thing. You don't want to fall. So I'm going to come up here. <clears throat> what we're going to do is we need to position the cog wheel perfectly so I can I can reverse it. And then I need to position wheel on the cog so that I can jump up there. It didn't work. Let's try her again. And that's it right there. And then you come up here and you jump. And here we are. And now we have to jump up here. So, once we're here, we're going to ignore this little flippy switch. It turns on the electricity. And we don't really want that right now. So, we're going to ignore that too. And we're actually going to come over here. And we're going to take this little minecart thing that actually turns on the light when you move it. Right about there. So you can get that switch and fall on top of it. So what we do then, is we actually come over to this thing. And push it all the way over to this side. Climb up and jump over, climb up, and then we have to wait to time this little flippy switch because it does cool things. So I would time it right about there. So you can come over, jump on top, climb up, have it roll over, jump up there, climb over there, run over here, jump over here, grab onto that, and fall. And right there. Here we go. So exciting. So, uh, once we get over here, we can climb up here, and we need to time this pretty well. So what we need to do is time it so that when we get there and jump over it, we climb back onto here. And now we continue on. Okay, so this cart is going to come down here and hit the button, and turn on the electricity, so what we're actually going to need to do here is we're going to need to move this into position so that we can get up on top there while this cart comes down and gives us time to get across so we cannot die. Yes! Made it! Ugh! The only reason I say that is because I've tried this like 80 billion times. It's 
it's really difficult to do. But anyway, the next part here we need is another one of those change direction things. Problem is, we don't have much light. So, what we're going to need to do is you need to be very careful here. And you need to... I believe we need to jump here. Yes, we do. You don't need the light at all times as long as you pay attention to what's going on. Like, for example, that. And you can see that, oh my gosh, I need to jump over that. And, oh wow, look, there's a thing right there I can jump on. And, holy cow. This is pretty crazy. Alright, so... We're not going up there. We're going to take this little box here. And we're going to push it down there. And we're going to wait to see where it lands. So I cannot die while I come down here. And there we go. And moving on. Let's see what's next. What's in store for us next. Alright, so that's going to be the end of part 5 of our walkthrough. Uh, so thank you for watching and coming in next time in the next section.